Hey everybody, this is Bob, KK4 DIV with 73 Outdoors, and in today's video, I wanna get ahead of the questions. You know, I've been building this cheapest go kit on YouTube, and I know you're asking the questions. How much did it cost? Well, today's video, we're gonna cover that and hopefully answer your questions. I want this to be a quick video. I've already covered the cheapest go kit on YouTube in my past few videos. I've talked about the transceiver, talked about the antenna, talked about all the components of the go kit. And I just wanted to make a quick video, as I said in the intro, to answer your questions about how much everything costs. I'm gonna give a quick breakdown of each individual itemized item. And in the comments section down below, or not the comments, but in the details section down below, the description section, I'm gonna put links to all these parts so you can go in there and find them yourself if you wanna create something similar. So, starting at the top, the most important component of this go kit is obviously the transceiver, the micro SDR transceiver I purchased on eBay. It was $129.99 when I purchased it. It's still $129.99 today if you purchase it from the seller I got it from. Now there's other sellers on eBay that sell these same radios. I've heard mixed reports about these radios. Some work well, some use cheaper components. I'm not sure if all of them are gonna work the same as mine, but I can say for my seller, the one I purchased works well. So the next item on this go kit is the rugged nano dipole sold by Tim Ortiz in 9 SAB. We've already covered that in the previous video. It costs $36.95. I purchased it because it's small, it's compact, he sells others, but I got the 20 meter version because that's the band I'm gonna find myself on most often. $36.95 eBay sold by Tim Ortiz. The third component is the coax, RG174 coax. I got a 20 run of it. When I purchased it, it was $21.99. Prices have gone up. Things have changed since then. I only purchased it less than six months ago, but instead of $21.99 for that uh, run of coax, it is now $23.74. But it's good coax. It's that thin stuff that packs down small. Uh, it's got B and C's on both ends and it's worked out really well for my little go kit. Now, so far, all these items I've been purchasing from eBay. The third thing is something I've had for quite a while, but you're gonna need it because you need some way to power this radio. Uh, the battery I've been using is the Talent Cell. The Talent Cell 12 volt, 6,000 milliamp hour battery. I purchased this from Amazon, and this thing runs $33.99. Can't remember how much I paid for it. Like I said, it's been a few years since I purchased it, but right now, $33.99. I wanna say it was right around $30 when I purchased it, $29.99, but still, $33.99 for this battery isn't a bad deal and it's a good battery and it's held up well. I've used it for various things. So those are the things what I consider the core, the bare bones go kit. And if you're just wanting to get that bare bones go kit, the radio, the antenna, the coax and the battery so you can get on the air, that's all you really need to get on the air. Um, it's going to cost $223.68. Not a bad price for a little. Now, if you want to continue on with the kit as I created it, you're going to need a few more things. Uh, you're going to need a telescoping bamboo pole. Unfortunately, the one I purchased, uh, I got it from Amazon again a number of years ago at the recommendation of uh, another YouTuber. Those aren't available on Amazon anymore. And I don't really, I've looked through Amazon. I could not find the same pole. I found some that similar, but not the same. I like these poles. I did find something pretty close to it on eBay. Uh, they're just bamboo telescoping poles. $38.99 uh, may be the closest thing you can get to this pole. It's still not exactly the same, but it's pretty darn close. Uh, next, as we're going along to make the kit exactly like mine, is the replacement speaker mic. Now, 
I had been using a replacement speaker mic that I used with another Wushan radio a while back. Uh, the it was getting kind of old and the cord was starting to fray in a couple spots. So I have since quit using that. And now I have just a Bofang hand mic that I purchased. And you can get those Bofang hand mics really dirt cheap. Uh, $10.84 off of Amazon. Uh, so you can get that as well. Uh, and the next few things are stuff I've had laying around. Um, you can purchase them if you need to, but I'm willing to bet a lot of people have these hanging around, so you're really not going to need to go out and purchase something. Uh, a plastic tent stake. And if you're going to buy one, I think you can get them for a couple bucks, probably a $1.99 or something like that at Walmart. Uh, just a plastic tent stake. Uh, a metal tube uh, that goes over that tent stake to set the bamboo pole into. That metal tube was just a scrap I had laying around. You could probably use a piece of PVC pipe, something like that, but I'm willing to bet you're probably gonna have something laying around that you can use as well. Uh, some paracord. Everybody, hopefully, has paracord laying around or some sort of rope, string, something that you can use to tie down the ends of the, uh, the antenna and something you can use to tie the antenna to the top of the mast. I just, like I said, I use paracord. I have it around for everything and I didn't add it into the cost because everybody's got string or something they can use laying around. And the last thing, and I didn't know if I wanted to add this or not, is the pouch that I used to put everything in. That, that Molly pouch, it's got the Molly attachments on the back. Again, that was from Maxpedition. I can't find it on Amazon anymore. I think it's discontinued. I even went to Maxpedition's website. I did not see it anymore, but I did find something that's going to be pretty close that I think is going to work, and I found that on Amazon as well. It's the Wynex, W-Y-N-E-X, Tactical Molly EDC pouch. Uh, again, sold on Amazon. It's $22.99. All right, so if you get all those items, it's going to be very close to what I have in my kit. Like I said, some of the things aren't available anymore, but those items that I put in as a replacement, that's going to get you pretty close to the kit I have. If you get all those items, you're looking at $296.50. You're under $300 for a go kit that's going to get you out in the field and get you going. You're not going to find that in anywhere else, I don't believe, for a sideband radio uh, that will also do CW that you can get out portable and have a lot of fun with and not spend a whole lot of money. Most radios, if you want a decent radio, it's going to cost you $400. I think the Zygu G90, I think it's the G90, is going to be you know, $400 by itself. So you're looking at under $300 to get you a little go kit. You can take out, have fun, get on the air, maybe do a little bit of POTA activation, which is one of my favorite things to do, and just maybe have fun down at the park, keep it in the car, keep it in the truck, use it whenever you want to. So that's it guys, like I said, I wanna maintain this video under 10 minutes, hopefully this came in under 10 minutes and uh, give you the breakdown of all the items. If you like what you see, please give this video a thumbs up. I really do appreciate everybody watching my videos and subscribing to the channel. And we will hopefully see you in a future video. From Bob, KK4DIV and Channel 73 Outdoors, we will see you next time, bye-bye.